Hey guys, welcome back. So today I have for you my summer capsule wardrobe haul and try on. Now, if you guys don't know what the heck I'm talking about, I recently did a video on how I'm building my summer capsule wardrobe. So if you guys are interested or want to learn a little bit more about my process, I'm gonna link the video below. But now here we are and I have the pieces. Now, like I mentioned to you guys in the video, there were some that were maybe, there were others that I was a little bit unsure. Um, everything could change, but in fact is that I wasn't gonna buy more than 10 items so I think we have seven um, which I'm missing one that it didn't arrive until this video but you're gonna see it obviously on my summer capsule wardrobe so without all that rambling let's start okay now one of the things that was on the list was a new pair of denim jeans and I know this seems boring but to me denim is just a fabric that I always depend on I love a good pair of denim jeans so I do like to splurge on them now I wanted to buy a new pair of Levi's um, because they're like my favorite brand when it comes to jeans and so I pick up always mine from Revolve and I got this pair which these ones are I think they're called the wedgie now I love the back they're just like my number one thing when it comes to Levi's and I also love the fact that the closure is basically just buttons so now I'm going to put this on and show you guys how they okay, look. Okay so these ones are the Levi's um, wedgies um, like I mentioned to you guys before I picked them up 25 because um, I am a 26 but I always size them down because they eventually stretch out so if you really want them to fit you up better definitely size down a bit because after you wash them they get a little bit loose but as you guys can see they're really fitted um, now when it comes to the length it's funny because they were supposed to be 27.5 and I think they're a little bit long but I can roll them up a little bit and they have a really nice bum and I think that's why a lot of people love them because they really give you like a wedgie and I think it's so flattering. Um, but nonetheless, I love these jeans and I don't care what I spend on them. They are always a cast of wear item that I'm never disappointed to get. So yeah, love them. Now onto the next item. Now, if you guys remember, there was so much reformation on that last video that it looked like a reformation paid ad. I mean, I wish, but uh, mostly there were so many pieces from them that I wanted to get that unfortunately, a lot of them are still not available. Like I'm legit on the waiting list when it comes to the Kyla dress, the shorts, the bathing suit. So because I didn't want it to wait any longer, I waited into their new in and so I did. And I'm so happy because I actually picked up a dress that it so beautiful now this one is called the Brianna dress and is a hundred percent linen and if you guys remember that video linen was the fabric of choice for me um, to use this month so I decided to invest on this one and it's so gorgeous I mean I know that it's black but trust me I'm gonna show you guys so many ways that you can rock this but love it so let me show you how it looks okay guys so this is the reformation Brianna dress um, now Something that I want to mention before I forget, this dress doesn't have any zippers. I didn't know that, I don't know if Reformation dresses don't own zippers, but trust me, to put this on was a hassle and thankfully I got it size 4. If I wouldn't get this size 2, I don't think I would be able to fit this thing in because you have to fight for it. Um, but I'm so happy that I went for this size and I think first thing first is because of the boobs. Um, I feel if I wouldn't go size down, I wouldn't be able to fit them. And I really love just how they look now. As you can see, it's quite long. Um, but I love it. And obviously, I love me a slip every day. Uh, I don't know. I just really feel like Angelina Jolie every time that I just get my knee out. Um, I, I did it as well with my Sarah's dress that is really similar to this one. But I love it on black, guys. I think it looks so beautiful. And again, because it's linen... Um, it's a little bit wrinkled, so it's something that I think I would came across with it, but I couldn't mind. Um, it's so comfortable, and I think this just wins over the fact of the chipping and what it took me to get it, but I love it. Um, I don't know if I mentioned you guys that it comes in red and also in this white print, but definitely black is the style, and I feel like this with a pair of white sneakers with obviously some wrap sandals. Now, another item that was on the list was a pair of linen shorts. Um, now, of course, the ones from Reformation were on the top of my list, but unfortunately, they're not available. But they brought another style which has more of a button, not a wrap 
um, style so those well they're out of stock as well but I found also in a way that I like them as well and if I could have find something similar I was gonna get it and so I went to my trusty Zara which they had a massive sale and I came across this ones and I'm so happy because I was really not expecting to find them but they're so similar that I love them now these ones are I think their fabric is lyocell, so they're not linen, but they're close by it. I kind of like the fabric because it's really thin, but most so I like most so more so I love the color. You guys remember I wanted to get something into this brownie camo shade, and I love how they look on me. Now I also love the fact that it has like a tortoiseshell button. Um, they're high waisted and they're just perfect. So let me show you how they look. These are the Sara. Um shorts like i mentioned you guys um they're high-waisted which i love and i also love the fact that it has pockets and you can see here it has like a little bit of a shorter shell now this one are size extra small i tried them medium and they didn't fit up right so i think if you find them definitely go size down because i think they're definitely are more flattering and i just really love how they look um they're quite cute i love the bag as well so i don't know i think they're perfect for summer um they really are comfortable and i love obviously the stitching right here i think it just makes them look a little bit better um but they're just perfect i love the camel i just well, not the camel toe. Probably I do have it with this. Um, but I love the camel shade. And yes, I think they're really cute and perfect for summer. Now, another item that was on the list was a linen top. Um, as I mentioned to you before, there was one from Reformation that I wanted. But to be honest, right now we're hitting almost the 100 degrees weather here. So buying a long sleeve top doesn't make any sense um, because it's so hot I'm sweating a lot I don't think that it would be practical so I decided to search on just something in a more practical matter so one with like a cami top or a shorter sleeve one and Sarah had their new in section so in there I find out this one and I'm so happy that I did um, and it's this button short sleeve one now um, this one it almost like a blue white if that makes any sense because it isn't like yellowy so I think that's why I like it I love the buttons because they have almost like a style like a little wood detail which I think is so cute but I love, love, love the sleeve. I love the fact that they're rolled up. And I'm thinking of maybe wrapping it below and have all the button loose like um, Julie Sarinanya from Sincerely Jewels does all the time with her Suzanne stuff. Um, I don't know, I feel really inspired. And I try it on with the shorts and they look so good together. And let me show you. Now this is the linen top, um, yes, as I mentioned you guys, I think I'm gonna wear it like this with like really, just with a twist below, I think it looks really cute, um, and I love the fact that without putting all the buttons, she already like closed it, which I think is perfect, I love the shoulders, I think it's so cute, but I love, love, love the way that this top looks, like I mentioned you guys, with the shorts, I think like this with denim is gonna look so cute as well. Um, but I love it. Um, it's so comfortable. Um, let me get this out just to show you guys without flashing you how it what it looks. Let me close this thing. Okay, so I just closed down the button just to show you very briefly how it looks if I'm just rolling them up. Um, yes, and it still looks quite pretty. Um, so it's, again, I feel like it's really versatile. It's quite nice. I love the material and it isn't too long as well. So I think it's just perfect, but to me, my favorite way of wearing this top definitely should be with a twist on them. I think it just makes it look really cool and really comfortable for summer, but yes, love this top. Now, another thing that was on the list was the satin top from Banana Republic. So that one was scratched out of the list because of the weather. So when I came across this top in Zara, um, I fell in love with it. And I think it's because of the fact that it is cotton, um, which is perfect for this time of year. And it's this, I think it's like a bustier top. Um, I don't know why I ended up loving it. And I think it's because I tried it on with denim jeans and it looked very well together now this top um 
Either way, I'm gonna show you how it looks and I'm gonna talk you very briefly what the heck I did to it. Okay guys, so this is the Sara Bustier top. I'm gonna name it because I just don't know the correct name. Um, but yes, it's just a really simple, in a way, crop top. Um, I definitely love the sleeves, but I also love like the little heart shape because if you have boobs, I think they're really flattering. Now, the thing that I was mentioning you guys about is that, as you can see, it has these metals and they're a bit comfortable. So I ended up getting was removing half of the ones on the side. So this sh it should be looking like this, but because I removed most of them, it's a little bit more stretched out, which I could care less. Now it is comfortable for me to wear. And like I mentioned you guys, I like to wear it with denim. I think this will also look really cute with like a satin top. I feel like with anything that's really high waisted, it can work. But if you have the body, you can wear this with anything. So I don't know. Overall, I really like it. It's comfortable for this weather, and I really love any white crop top every day of the year. So yeah, love it. Now let's talk about accessories because there were a few that I wanted to get, and the first one, which you guys know was this lack of color border head. Now, I did a little bit of an unboxing bit. If you guys want to see it, I'm gonna link right now my Instagram so you can go and have a look if you really want to know how it comes packed. Um, but I mean, as you see it here, it's as beautiful in real life. Um, I don't know why, I always have been so into border hats. I think because Chanel, um, they look so beautiful, so chic, um, so just, Basically, I feel like they just elevate a look in a second. Now, um, I think this one was almost like $79. And then I think they charged me $10 for the chip-in. Um, and of course, it, I believe it comes from Australia. So it was, it was really fast, which I was really impressed. I think not less than a week, I had it home. And I love it. Let me show you how it looks like with the whole outfit. Okay guys, so this is what I mean when I put an outfit with this hat. It's just make it look so cool. Um, and I feel like it really elevates a look in no time. And I just really love how thin it is. Um, just how beautiful they made it. I think it's perfect. I like to use it, for example, creating a knot on my back. And just really putting it like this. I think it looks really cute. I feel like this with the dress, with anything that I would wear, it would make it... Um, incredible and I think it's such a hat that you can wear as well in fall um, just basically all year around it just really makes an outfit super uber chic so love it and I really love it with this style I feel like this with the straw back I'm just ready to get out of the door I think it's so cute and so summer so love my lack of color hat I think it's really cute Okay, now lastly, now um, first, uh, let me mention you guys before that I'm waiting on a belt. I picked up this belt from H&M. If you guys remember, I mentioned that I wanted to buy just a simple black belt. I don't think there's nothing too much about it. I'm going to put the picture. I haven't received it yet, but obviously you're going to see it on my summer capsule wardrobe video. But then the other thing that was really important to me was a pair of wrap sandals. Now, again, I got this one from Sarah and they were really inexpensive. I think that's why I like them. They come in a lot of sh in a lot of shades and in a lot of forms. Um, this ones are like a false leather strappy style one. Now I love how they look, but just to warn you guys, they're a bit uncomfortable. And I believe it's this area right here where you put your toe. Um, nonetheless, they look great. I'm hoping that they stretch out a little. I don't know if that makes any sense, or they're just basically going to be like that forever. Um, but I always use sandals. To me, it's like an everyday shoe, so um, always a cast of wear gets in there. So yeah, let me show you how they look. These are the Sarah wrap sandals. Um, like I mentioned to you guys before, they're a little bit uncomfortable on the toe area, but other than that, they look quite nice. And if, for example, if you're wearing this one, which are tan, I think they look really cute because they almost look like something. So they really are blendable with everything that you have, but I really love this style um and yes definitely want to get different shades because i use them so much so guys this is it this is my summer capsule wardrobe try on haul um i hope that you guys love it like always everything is going to be linked below if you guys are interested in any of the items shown here and don't forget to watch my upcoming summer capsule wardrobe video which i hope that it should go live in a week and a half they just cross fingers um and oh and also want to give the mentioning that i changed my favorites onto my instagram so now if you guys want to see what i'm loving each month they're gonna be into the highlights on their faves and yep guys this is it so now it's time for me to go and watch stranger things season three because today is fourth of july 
and yep we're on so cannot wait to binge watch one of my favorite shows so yep i'll see you next time with a video bye